good evening and welcome to Eswatini Lifestyle. This is Shuki Lamini, your wonderful host. And on today's special segment, she's only here to solely bring you nothing but the best of the entertainment scene in the kingdom of Eswatini. We all know that with COVID, our favorite events had been, you know, put on a standstill. But now with everything opening up, baby, everything is getting bigger and better. I'm here to tell you that the epic gig Eswatini is back with the bang. You know what? I don't want to ruin it and say a lot of things. Let's just go check it out. fan followers this is your girl Chuki Lamini and today she is bringing you the most exciting news ever we are at the launch of the third edition the epic gig is Swatini and if you don't know what the epic gig is I feel so sorry for you where on earth have you been hiding the epic gig is an annual event that brings together southern Africa in one of the biggest stages in Swatini we have local artists performing and it is going to be amazing it is happening on the 25th of June so stay tuned Swatini lifestyle viewers all around me. I'm surrounded by beautiful people and I came across this really beautiful, 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 beautiful girl. And she's going to actually tell us who she is. Hi. Hi everyone. Um, my name is Nogan Nshabasi, but I'm known as Knox. Um, I'm one of the Epic Gig ambassadors for this year. So yeah. <laughs> Isn't she pretty? So as the ambassador, I'm sure you know a lot about Epic Gig. Uh -huh. First things first. Why are we in black? Okay. Who died? <laughs> so this is going to be our one of the colors of our um, event this year. You're going to see a lot of black, you're going to see a lot of red, you're going to see a lot of yellow. So it's going to be us just playing around with a few colors. But tonight we just decided, you know, let's start things off with black. Yeah, right. Now can we take it to the rest of the proceedings tonight? I know we haven't started, but what are, the, what are your expectations for the launch? Um, today we're basically going to be sensitizing people about the event, first of all, and um, there's going to be the reveal of the first phase lineup. So today we're going to get a little bit of inside information on what's going to be going on on the 25th. So I'm really looking forward to that because I also don't know the, the, the artists that are going to be here. So I'm really excited about that. Who are you hoping to see perform? Who are you hoping? Fingers crossed to go to there in the lineup. Uh, I'm gonna have to say Musa Keys. I really wanna, I really wanna see that man again, guys. I really wanna see him again. So Musa Keys, I'm fingers crossed he's coming. Fingers crossed. Okay, thank you so much. See you on the 25th. I will see you guys on the 25th. I will be there. I hope you will be there. And please do come, come through, guys. It's going to be a vibe. I promise. Right now with me, I am with the courtesy of hip hop in our all black formal way, which he doesn't have, and I'm wondering why. Why? I'm already the black Superman, so oh, okay. <laughs> so if I reveal, if I take off the shirt, you know. But uh, yeah, it was just one of those things whereby I mean. Can I be honest, honest for real, for real? I was, I was on my way from another event uh -huh. where I was actually uh, hosting there as well. Yeah. And 
I was trying to honor the time for this event so I couldn't go home, change into my black Superman outfit and then come back here. So I was just like, my presence is more important than my fashion. You know, we're just going to pretend you also went black, you know, for the viewers. It's yeah, fine. Yeah, all black everything. <laughs> yeah. So how is it uh, hosting, I mean, yes, hosting yeah. the launch of the Epic Gig? Um, first and foremost, thank you to uh, Toxic and the Epic Gig team for just like recognizing uh, me and, and, and seeing me fit to host an event. First of all, it feels back. It feels good to be back home, yeah. and now being back home and then being put on on a stage, standing in front of people. That's the one thing I love more than anything else. So it's just so nice to be back home and back in the groove of things. And I loved everything about this event. I love the energy. I love the crowd, and I love the lineup. So I'm just yeah. looking forward uh, to to the actual event on the 25th of June. So in short, you're also emceeing on the 25th of June. Hey, uh, I'm, you know what? I'm not saying anything. Uh -huh. I'm just saying I'm going to be here. You're going to be here. I'm going to be here. Whether on the stage, whether I'm running security, where I, I, the bottom line is I'm going to be here. Yeah, we'll have to see if Black Superman. <laughs> you're one of, uh, of Eswatini's favorite local hip-hop artists. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yes, but well, you didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know. <laughs> thank you, Eswatini. <laughs> well, okay. Yeah. So how, how, how? How are you feeling? Um, maybe what's your advice to the to the other upcoming people that will be on the freshman stage? All right. Uh, look, if you're gonna, if you ever have an opportunity to stand behind a microphone and to stand in front of a crowd, all I'm saying is go out there, do you, boo boo. You know, <laughs> be yourself and and just and leave, leave everything on that stage because yeah. you never know who's in the crowd you never know who's watching you never know who your next your next gig that could take you to the next level yeah. could, could could be right where you are so go out there jump on that stage have fun mm -hmm. uh you know represent yourself represent your your family your community your village your your your, your country and especially for a, a stage like this one where we're where we're, we're, we're performing alongside uh visiting artists or South African artists, it's time for us to show that we're right there with the rest of them. Yeah. We're right there with the best of them. We're punching in the same weight class and uh, more than anything, just go out there and have fun. Thank you. Yeah. Do have yourself an amazing night. All right, you too. Thank you so much. We are still at the Epic Gig 2022 launch. And of course, with me right now, I have Keisha from Kosha Bushe Ben Fombi. Keisha, how are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm fine. She is actually one of the biggest sponsors here tonight. She sponsored the brand ambassadors of the Epic Gig. I just want to find out, Keisha, what uh, makeup, sorry, what, what, what was the inspiration behind the face and everything? So basically we were going for a um, special occasion look, seeing that the Epic Gig is a special occasion, seeing it happens once a year. It is one of the biggest events in Eswatini. Proudly, happily to be a part of the event and the team. Yes. So how, how has the experience been sponsoring the Epic Gig? It's been amazing. The girls are very friendly. They are beautiful they've got amazing skin they're bubbly they literally made it easy for me yes you know still on, on the business side of things what does Kosha, Kosha Bushleben Hombi represent we are basically in the field of beauty we are a company that deals with beauty we help people enhance their looks we help them look whatever way they feel comfortable in within their own skin we offer services such as microblading which is a semi-permanent brow yeah. we offer um, makeup services eyelash extensions we offer training we, we do manicures pedicures massages facials you name it anything in the beauty field we've got you so there's someone right now who's watching and they're like, man, I want to learn, man, I want your services. Where can they find you physically and maybe on the social? So we are currently on Instagram and Facebook, um, Kosha underscore Buche underscore Ben um, We are also based at Riverstone Mall. We are upstairs next to Interchange, shop 1.01. Yes. You've given me the shop number, so I'll come for my free face bit me. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> Please um, do. Thank you so much. Do enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you so much, and thank you for having me.
watching your lifestyle viewers with me right now. I am steady chilling with MLM and he is looking dapper. MLM, how are you? I'm blessed, man. How are you doing? Uh, well, I guess I'm blessed too, you 100%, know? 100%, 100%. It's that smile though, huh? <laughs> you know, it's the screen smile, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, do your thing, do your thing, but we shine bright like a diamond, you know what I mean? Ooh, okay. Yeah. Now let's take it to tonight, yeah? yeah? We're at the Epic Geek launch. The theme is all black formal and you're looking amazing with a touch of red can we just take me through your outfit inspiration how you pissed your outfit together generally i don't do all black that's my thing uh, i'm black myself so Ooh. i try to bring some color out uh, but i did all black it was super amazing uh, but i always have to have a touch of color so yeah uh, these are a brand of my friends um this was put together this pants and shirt was put uh, pants and Jacket was put together by one of my friends. This was definitely uh, sent out by my homie out uh, Sandy Sile out in Pretoria. So major shout out to him. And yeah, my hats are all. Anyone who knows me knows I rock my hats, man. And then shades are my thing. Yay. Yeah, I'm incognito. The, the future's too bright, man. You know, gotta wear yeah. shades. I, I see it further. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, right. So again, tonight. What are your expectations for the launch? What are you hoping to maybe find out? Oh man, I don't have any expectations, man. Mm. I'm just here to support local. That's yeah. all it's about. Support local, make sure the guys come up and have a great thing. Whatever happens tonight, happens tonight. We're here to support. Uh, we're keen for the lineup and see what, it's all, what the lineup's all about. But really, outside of that, we're just here for a good night. Yeah, it's a good night. It's yeah, about man. to be a good night. Yeah, man. <laughs> and everyone else, man. It's peace, love, and happiness. Yeah. That's my, that's my mantra. Peace with yourself, love yourself, happy with yourself. So you can be at peace with others, love others, and be happy with others. That's all yeah. it is. Yeah. You know what? Keep being blessed. I'm blessed as well. Thank you for your Major time. Major shout out. Major shout out. Check out Music Loves Man underscore entertainment on all social media, man. We out there. Peace. As Swatini Lifestyle viewers, I must say, Sam's we are stalker in Swatini Lifestyle. Last week we were with him in Bombela and today was Lanzelela in Marken's Country Club. Why are you following us around? I think that should be, that is, that is a very good thing that for once uh, it is me who is following you guys, <laughs> not you guys following me. <laughs> yeah, it's actually a good thing. How are you feeling tonight? How are you feeling about you know, the epic gig coming back? I'm feeling really good. Um, of, of course, we are all looking. We were all lo looking forward to actually having the industry open up, exactly. and you know, we urge all sources to actually continue supporting because we are growing the industry. And you know, if we do not support the local industry, then who will? Yeah. So you're fresh from performing. Yep. How was the performance? Uh, well, uh, I would always ask you. As a person who watched, you know, <laughs> I mean, because I was performing, so. <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> I'm feeling good. I'm yeah. feeling good. Uh, I'm really excited mm -hmm. for such opportunities locally. Yeah. You know, often we would find appreciation outside of the country, but now we are getting it locally, and yeah. we would really love to to give our all locally more than we can actually give anywhere else. Yeah. So before I let you go, let me put you on the spot. Who are you most excited to see on the stage on the 25th? I'm excited to see myself yeah. and I can't wait. Okay, <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I feel you. <laughs> it's what you need, Lifestyle viewers. I know you guys would actually kill me if I did not have an interview with the founder of the Epic Gig and it is none other than Mr. Toxic. Mr. Toxic, how are you? I'm good to to yourself and uh, now uh, hello to everyone at home. Man. Yeah, I'm fine and I hope everyone else is fine. No, I hope so. It's because, you see, the people actually watching us, those are the people that matter the most, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. They are the ones that are actually going to be there on the 25th. You see, they've been filling up this place right here. Yeah. yeah. So why are we in black though? You know, the reason why we did black is our corporate colors, the epic gig is black and red. Uh -huh. So we thought, you know what, let's let's bring the colors to life. You know, why, why change a color and put on another color? Uh -huh. It's an executive color. Yeah. So we said, yeah, now let's pop. <laughs> Of course, the epic gig means it is epic. And actually, this year, you know, I don't want to ruin the moment, but this year, there's something special happening. Epic gig, and whatnot. And Mr. Toxic is actually going to get further into that. 
Well, this year, guys, for episode three of the Epic King, it's going to be a two-day thing. So the first day is going to be the Epic Arts and Culture Festival, where we're basically inviting all the school kids to come basically showcase their talent, have fun, and we're going to bring a South African act to basically this the stage. And we're going to have the round table as well for called Asukutulisane, where all artists, where all designers, everyone in the entertainment sector or scene is invited to come basically we're going to have a dialogue on how to package the art how to sell it how to manage it and how to advertise the thing and take it to the world you know like we're basically taking venek to the world let people know siswati through your songs and your artworks and everything <laughs> and then obviously on the 25th we're going to have the main day that's going to start at 3 p.m and we've got a major lineup you know they must just check out on the epic gig uh, Insta pages, and then they're gonna have all the information there on who's performing, when, and how. I actually wanna put you on the spot now before I let you go. Who are you most excited to see on the stage on the 25th? I want like I'm 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 expect you see I'm excited when I see Swazi artist. So I'm excited to see them perform along the big guys. Yeah. You see, I'm excited to see Bo IRC, Tibo Bay Bash performing alongside both them too, yeah, the Bo, Bo Jezik and yeah. stuff. And I'm excited to see the Bo, Bo, the girls, you know, performing alongside Bo Costa Teach and all those guys, Bo Cuesta, you know. It, it's, it's exciting to see how they react to the South African film, you understand? Because they mustn't be intimidated, you know. They've got equal talent or even better. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much for your time. See you on the 24th and the 25th. Definitely, definitely. Everyone must go buy the tickets at Compute Ticket and all Kalitos. from the epic gig third edition launch right here at Malkins Country Club. We've seen the lineup, we've seen some of the biggest names on the South African charts and of course some of the biggest names on the local charts. And I am most excited to see our locals outshining themselves, outdoing themselves and actually representing Eswatini and Frog, if I could say, I could say Ayasilti, you know, I could say Sanilo. I'm happy, I'm really stoked to see them on the stage. And from Eswatni Lifestyle and your girl, Chukil Jamimi, hope to see you on the 25th and you better show up. Don't forget that line up phase two is still on the way. Good night. has touched down in the country and of course it is none other than bushfire it is about to be amazing it is about to be bigger and better and everyone has been anticipating on this one and of course because the Swatini lifestyle held down the fronts over there at the epic gig launch the beatdown also held down the fronts on our behalf at the bushfire launch over there at house on fire let's go check it out Are we happy to be at the MTN Bushfire 2022 launch? Are we excited for the 2022 MTN Bushfire Festival? Make some noise! Yeah. If you I love MTN Bushfire, let me hear you say yeah! yeah. Say yeah! yeah. Alright, we're still together. So, ladies and gentlemen, today we are resetting, reigniting the 
very much thing and uh, they are with me the question of the MTN Bush fire. So we hope all of us will be bring our fire this year. So MTN will be giving away tickets. I'm sure you've been seeing the prices here. Uh, the tickets are available, but we will be giving away tickets to our customers. We want you to get vaccinated for yourselves, for your friends, for your families, for your communities. We want you to come and enjoy Bushfire safely. I had two friends today reach out from Mozambique and South Africa and say, yeah, I got my Bushfire tickets, I'm coming over. Great, let's all do it safely together. Uh, hopefully everyone can go back to your communities, your churches, and just rally the troops, right? Let's get out, let's get vaccinated, let's get ahead of the next wave of COVID-19. Let's do it safely and have a great time at Bushfire. I think we can't wait. Uh, again, thanks you know, really from the bottom of our heart just letting us be a part of this uh, tremendous effort and uh, for incorporating uh, the vaccination effort into it. Thank you so much. Hello, Swaziland. My name is Kole. I'm your local Afro jazz singer. I am so excited here tonight because I'm at the launch of Bushfire. It's been almost, what, two years and we are back. Bushfire is back. Life is back. The arts are flourishing. I'm just happy to be here to also start the fire. My name is DJ Cybers and I'm out here at House on Fire, man. It's 2022 and we're back, baby. Forget the last two years and what happened. We're here. I'm so excited because what's going to happen this year is going to be like a repeat of what we've had for the longest time in our lives, but we are back here. So listen, do, my, do yourself a favor, buy yourself a push ride ticket, come out, it's going to be amazing. I, I'm really hoping I'm going to be a stage, I don't know, I don't know, probably I will be though. But anyway, come out, 27, 29 May, 2022, you best be here. Good evening, San Bonani and uh, welcome to House on Fire. A very special night tonight. We launch MTM Bushfire 2022. It's been a long time coming, two years. Uh, we speak about resetting, uh, re-imagining, reawakening, and reigniting. And it all happens in a very special way tonight where the industry comes back together, celebrates itself, um, as it re-emerges and uh, what an amazing year we have ahead of us. Uh, the festival develops in amazing ways. We have uh, amazing new partnerships. We have amazing new developments within the festival arena. We have uh, very dynamic new uh, artists joining our stage from within Eswatini, the region and the globe. So. Let's look forward to a, an extremely special event uh, as we re-emerge um, out of COVID in 2022. Ah, uh, my baby's mommy, good news, is signing out right about Jenga Manje. But I hope to see all your lovely faces, all your lovely outfits and the vibes that you guys are going to bring at the Epic Gig and the Bushfire. So please don't disappoint. When I come to interview, what are you trying to happen? What exactly are you trying to happen? Anyway, from me, Chikitem Verandamini and the Eswatini Lifestyle Crew, good night.